art is not meant to be to just please everyone or to decorate the house, let's say. I think art meant to make people feel something. All art needs to have certain message. That's what I try to do with my art. I try to have a strong message in each of my paintings. Because that's my way of communication with the world. It's um, international language, if you want to call it that way. <laughs> It starts with the feeling, with an, an emotion that I go through at the moment. I think that's the main power of inspiration. And it's just when I find the right elements. Sometimes it's one photograph I've seen here, and maybe a landscape, surreal landscape that came into my mind. They come together and they help me to show the emotion through subjects, let's say. It's hard to explain. It's a lot of daydreaming, too. <laughs> Halo is one of the elements that you can see in most of my paintings. It's the element I, I try to keep and be recognized by. I spent a long time studying Renaissance and Russian iconography, which they always will have that Halo element. It really brings the attention to the face. I like to have that kind of geometry in my paintings. I usually start with the colored pencils and it will have a cross hatch technique. And then, then on top of that, I will start to use acrylic washes. And sometimes I will come back and retouch it with pencil again to define the details. So it's really a mixed media. It's more recognizable as my style because you can still see a pencil and a paint at the same time. I love gold and silver leaf. I think it, it creates the, that shine that makes it more interesting in a way, or it will create another dimension of the painting. It really helps for a main element to stand out when I use a background of silver or, or gold leaf. My body painting work started 10 years ago. It's a different medium. You paint on a skin, on like a human. There is some magic to it. Um, I think for every person, I keep hearing this kind of feedback that it helped them to love themselves more, love their body more. It's not my main focus, but I love to do it sometimes. If I had all the time in the world, I would probably spend so much more time on my paintings because I'm a perfectionist, so I always will try to make it better. <laughs> I mean, when I have to stop, I stop and I make my peace with it, even if it's not exactly as I want it, but that part of letting go is easy for me now. It was not always this way, but I think over years it comes with professional skill of letting your paintings go. 